Right guys and girls, Mark Crossfield here. In my hands today I've got the brand new Ping Drivers in the G430. So I've actually got the Max in my hand here and the LST. There's a straight fit technology LST. This is the low spin technology Max kind of everyone's club. There's also straight fit technology, which is the one that's going to try and calm shapes, uh, you know, kind of curvatures, those kind of things. I haven't got that one. It's also a high launch bracket in these sets of clubs, which we'll do another video on. We're going to concentrate on the Max and the LST. These ones really are the two most people are asking questions about. Let's show you what all the new things Ping are saying this club will do. Think about the sounds and the feels. We've got numbers also. And I got special guests for a fun test at the end, so stay tuned. We have a fun test. This is the Max to kick us off. So down by the ball, it looks very much like a ping driver. The Max does really look maxi, like it presents huge down by the ball. Like the footprint is big. We're still seeing these turbulators, if they're still being called that. We're still seeing the crown internal dragonfly. We'll look at the tech. They're actually, you know, you almost see, they're trying to tell you it's in there by giving you visual on the outside. A little bit of aerodynamic dimpling on each side as well. And then we get this slightly grayer face to the black top. And as always, changeable neck, but it's super, super slim. Why other companies can't make their neck like this? I don't know, because it just looks so nice. And it just it must be so light, their neck. So let's see what it sounds like. Oh, a bit of that wow, and it sounds solid. So slightly pingy, it's titanium sounding. Um, and lovely lovely flight as i'd expect i mean i always get great numbers from ping drivers they're as good as anything we still see the changeable weight on the back as well we'll get into the tech like i say but that feels yeah pretty solid now for the first time the max looks different the max has a different looking crown if we're going just on looks alone i prefer the look of the max but with the lst we're seeing, so the LST is looking different for the first time. I don't know if I said Max or LST there, but the LST, the low spinning tech, the low spinning option, it's got this kind of carbon all across the top here. And I think it actually wraps around, but again, we'll look at that in the tech. Everything else does look very similar weight on the back turbulators. Face design looks very similar too. So are we gonna hear quite a different shape, oh, sorry, sound because of that carbon lid or not? Down by the ball, looks sits square, looks great. It's just the carbon crown is definitely different looking. Mm, it's a flatter flight, like that's bombie flight, which I like. Well, I would be interested to see which one's longer than the, out of those two, because I hit the max better, but that was definitely a low spin LST shot that on these ferries could run forever. Sound feel, oh, that wasn't much in it. Maybe slightly muted. Ting, they're the tingier side of drivers. So, you know, they're not like carbon soft. Hmm, they look good, like stealthy good. So there is the uh, Max right there. And the low spin has done it. I don't know if you can see that up there. The low spin has definitely run out more. Now the fairways are slopey here. This one could have quite easily landed here. It would have got that slope just rolled down. That one I don't reckon was carrying as much, but it's going to hit this slope. If it gets up it, you're getting a bit more roll because it comes down. But the low spin, as you'd imagine from low spin, has definitely moved on a good 20 paces there. Um, and that's always the beauty with low spin is it can give you your max hits, but at the same time, it can punish you and you do drop way back. Right, sorry to interrupt before we throw you straight back to the video. Just a quick note, if you're liking the video, don't be afraid to hit the like button and also subscribe if you don't want to miss the next great video. Other thing as well, I do a podcast with Lou Stagner, PJ Tour player Greg Chalmers. If you're into podcasts, link in the description. Check it out, let me know what you think. Sorry, back to the video. So Max again first. Massive change from the one before, the model before, no. I mean, Ping are saying, before we look at the tech, I've got some yardages actually, that they do state. Let, let's just see what they say. So they say for distance wise, so the LST they're saying is seven yards further, I presume from prior models. The driver in the Max is four yards, the straight fix technology we haven't got here, but it's all very similar, but you're gonna get your more dual bias 
is five yards further. Now think about those claims, they're robot tested, so you could get down to those margins. An amateur golfer trying to find seven, five yards longer, you are gonna have to hit so many shots because your standard deviation with drivers is gonna be like 20 yards. Um, so yeah, they are saying they're further. We're gonna show you the numbers. If they are, you're gonna struggle to find it, in my opinion. Max then, absolutely in the worlds of Maxes, it's frying pan large. Like it's gonna be one of the most favorite if you want a Max looking driver. That'll just rip that, absolutely rip that. It's into the wind now, so it's uh, they are going to stall this hot on this hole. But I've hit that well. Let's see if the low spin can get past it. Definitely, this is fun, different. It's interesting. It's it's a contrast in looks which you don't normally see. So with the LST into this wind, I do feel like I want this lower forward flight. Oh yeah, it is. We're going to have to go and see them down. They're equivalent hits. But that looked to my eye like such a forward, more like low flight. Right, before I show you what's happened here, which is quite funny, um, let's have a look at what Ping say about these clubs. What's the tech? What's new? What's changed? What are these engineers actually coming up with this time? But they haven't already done. So I've got the LST and the Max driver. There is also a straight fix uh, a SFT in this set of three drivers as well. So we've got transition design on the face. They're playing with the face. It's a forged VFT, variable face thickness, delivers more face flexing. Uh, its thickness equals 6% thinner, they're saying, I presume from prior models. Spincicity, the word that they've created, with variable roll radius. So they're trying to improve the carry and the spin when you hit it on top and the bottom of the club with the curvature and how they move the face. Sound solution. So they're working with the sounds to deliver really good sounding and feeling clubs as well. And then also they've got carbon fly wrap, which is exclusive to the LST where the carbon of the crown wraps around the back and almost around the sides. Again, I presume just trying to save weight so they can position weights where they need it to make that a low spinning, more powerful driver. The Max is high MOI. It's got the weight at the back as well. They both have the weight at the back for dialing in fitting options. You also have a fitting option on the neck. And again, Ping make probably the best, most uh, unoffensive looking neck. It's so small, the smallest out of all the companies. As always from Ping, pushing tech. They are saying that the LST driver is seven yards longer, the Max is four yards longer, and the SFT is five yards longer. Mm. And maybe go and test that. We could test that. Four yards would be interesting. Trying to find four yards longer, you're gonna need to get a lot of shots with your standard deviations. All right, after all that tech, that is the Max. And up there is the LST. I would say that is 40 yards further. Now, a few things to bear in mind from this to that. On the line, this one has to be drawn at this angle, not this way from where the T was, which would knock it down maybe to 25, 30 yards. Kind of puts us around here. Now, also on the line, if this one catches this channel, there's more slope. But I do think because of the wind, which we don't feel down here, but it's up there, and it's often breezy here. The two flights, the LST is just maxing out on this flight, and the max is not. But then we flip it around a downwind, and you might find that it evens out, and that's, again, where the danger is with how low you go in spins. And I know if I hit that LST on a high toe, I mean, it's just gonna dip out of the air, it's gonna be back in here. So it's, 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 Understanding your averages, we're gonna show you my numbers, but it's also understanding your standard deviations. As much as I try to say this, lots of people still, they're getting sold on averages of clubs, and I'll do more videos on this because it needs to get through. Understanding if the, if the LST max is out seven yards further than say the max for me, great, seven yards, I want every ounce I can get. But if the standard deviation is greater, so they fall in a tighter spell spot, with the max, meaning that the drop-offs of the LST are just too big. It'll just even all even out. And it'll be hard for me to know if I can carry stuff because I, I'm relying on outliers almost all the time. 
saying that. That's miles up there. So why don't you guys go and look at the numbers before I hit these last two drives and then we'll get the special guests in and see what they can get out of them. So taking a look at the numbers, one, uh, 161 with the max, 162 with the LSD, standard deviations overlapping those two. So ball speeds, that's my average, which I'm quite happy with, very similar. You can see the spin is that little bit lower, uh, 200 revs, I reckon if I just kept repeating this test. Three to 400 revs, I reckon you'd see in difference, but look at the standard deviations, it overlaps them both, which I quite like. You know, these, these two drivers should be, slightly overlapping, they're fractional fits. Launch angle the same, because obviously I'm fitted for these clubs, but I am squeezing that little bit more distance out of the LST because the spin is a bit lower. Again, the standard deviations of these overlap them, as you can see from the two circles here. So defining what is longer, if you imagine these two circles as my year's worth of drives, for instance, like they're averaging and peaking, like the peaks of both of them are close, aren't they? So it's really going to dial into what you like the feel of. And if you are really dialed into understanding two or 300 revs of spin being the winning goal, what I do like with the LST is the low spin version isn't crazy low. It's manageable. As always from Ping, very solid numbers. Be so tempted for the stress, uh, LST here as well out of these two. I'd have to give it a good test. The numbers are good. It feels so solid, like hilariously, like solid. The more I hit as well, I just like that slightly. I don't know if it's smaller, the smaller head over that footprint, certainly. And I'm quite liking the two colorways. I think it's, it's really starting to look quite cool. But I think for the masses, the max is just where it will be. It's confident, inspiring. It feels as solid. It looks great in that kind of dark finish. It is slightly louder sounding. I'm going to say it's slightly more, like it sounds faster to the person who doesn't quite, you know, that one sounds firmer. That one sounds faster. Let's get the special guests in. Let's see what they think. Two drivers, two chums, Matt and Trey, the worst two chums to play this game with. Where on earth is Pete? <laughs> <laughs> He's lost. He's We've around. lost our third chum, and he's the only one I can get close to. But we're going to do this now because I've committed to it from the start of the video. The game is so you can go low spin, or you can go max. So it's subject to if you're worried of tippy, uh, toey dippers, or you think you know, you're both faster than me. So you choose which one. You get two shots. You choose the longest one. I'll go last. I know which one I'm choosing because I have tested. <laughs> But they are exactly the same, to be fair, subject to... What would you like, sir? Do you, you want friendly first? or do you want punishing? I'm going angry and punishing club. Do it. What yeah. are you going for, Matt? I'm just going to see what Trey does. <laughs> we can't swap after our Once first. Do you get two drives, got to be the same driver. Oh, that's so hard. This is long drive, okay. Trey. You don't have to do it that hard because I'm playing. <laughs> <laughs> but the rock it's got to be on the green stuff and it can't be another fairway so it's got to be on green stuff fairway or rough but we've got to be green on our stuff so i want big sends that's not on the green stuff Unlucky. That's a high cut Healy cut and that, that one is slightly more fade biased out of the two because it's a low spin model they tend to set them up out of the two no he's in it too fiddling always trying to work it win. out <laughs> can no. you try and hit this one hard I know that okay. was a pack yeah, hard. We getting this yeah come on oh, oh that's yeah. he's not oh that's god I'm not even following that Oh. Yeah, fine, isn't it? He should have chose the max. That's what happens when I try and hit it hard. <laughs> out. Well, you took Trey out of the <laughs> arena. I'm literally going to be able to pat the max up there, aren't I? <laughs> it's full send. You've got a full send. I can full send pat anything. You can't tell the difference. Oh, no, no, that's oh. not on our green stuff. That's over there. That it, tree. Yeah. Oh, someone, That's... I'm just going to have to hit fairway, aren't I? <laughs> Actually, this is better because Pete might hit the fairway, so he can stay away. <laughs> if he comes, I'm going to say, now we're finished. <laughs> Sometimes. You've hit 
Matt's hit a turbulator on a ping driver before. <laughs> it was bloody windy. <laughs> No. Get down there. No, he yeah. sent one down there. Not going to see it down, but it was good. It's not bad. What are you doing? He hit that turbulator. I didn't. He I did. did. Yeah. <laughs> he did. I did. It was at Salton. It was, it was blowing a hoo. He hit it there. <laughs> it was it freezing. Hit that. If that turbulator wasn't there, he would have literally the ball would have just, but it just popped up. Good old turbulator. Could have almost caught it. <laughs> I did win that day though, Trey. <laughs> just to let we you know. We were the only three people on the course. <laughs> because it was not playable. He hit, he hit a putt that didn't hit the putt that moved, so the wind blew his putt, and he was like, did I hit that? <laughs> uh, you've gone low spin too, have you? Yeah. LST. Fair way to run it, you see. If I get one of these high, I could totally run it past you. Yeah. I'm not going to full could. speed it past you or carry it past you. You'd totally get it past me. I need... Sorry, I need it if I forgot. I was still in... Make part, make part. <laughs> I've changed, changed my theory. Now I'm going full sense. Intent oh. changed. Oh, I blocked it. Oh, it's going to get a hop off that back. That, that, that might back. kick left, but I don't Right think behind the sign. Left. If that gets good bounces on the old rock arch. You hit that really well. Did you? Like, it's because it's so far, Trey. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that come on. That's amazing that that didn't draw. That does show testament to this. Like that was a that with a max is drawing. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's good. Oh, that's, that's good. That's good. That is a winner. That's Do you reckon? A that's a Callaway. Do you reckon that's a winner? <laughs> <laughs> that's a yellow Callaway with these. That was on the it. perfect <laughs> high draw bomb. Let's wow. Go. That's a big one. You've picked the hole that's stupid for this. Oh, you have the win. That's longer. It's not on green, but it is. It's just that we've outrun the fairway. Like, I would never have picked this hole. I wasn't even trying to hit that bit. <laughs> we've got a five-yard fairway to hit. What I think's funny is, even when I'm trying, I still can't hit it in the trouble, even when I'm just trying to smash it. Just go. I want it just to go in there. No, because look, that's just going to go in there. That's probably going past yours, No, is it? it's not. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I haven't won, have I? I hit that well as well. I told you I was the yellow Callaway. I haven't won. Well, that's embarrassing. There you go, that's the new ping drivers. I'm still short, doesn't matter what those engineers do. 